welcome back to the channel folks um, very cold in Blackpool this afternoon it's only about 10 degrees uh, do you have a lot of wander around see front around the town have a look around see what's going on general uh, general look around really it's the uh, weekend of the Strictly Stars are in town today so we might even spot somebody famous we we'll never know <laughs> see you soon well, just in front of me here we've got the Holiday Inn Hotel uh, newly opened this uh, spring, back in May, I believe. Well, it seems a lifetime ago. Um, I've actually been told that the um, Strictly Stars are staying in this hotel as I walk past them. They're probably down the tower out there. I've been spotted this morning. They're probably in the tower now rehearsing for tonight's performance. Anyway, it'd be great if we could find somebody and see somebody, wouldn't it? So anyway, we'll have a look around to what we can see. And uh, it's the Holiday Inn here. It's the entrance. Can't see anybody famous. <laughs> I'll have a general look around anyway. Oh, we'd say it's the uh, biggest half square, it's the biggest half square here. We've got the new rail side um, brew house here. This is, uh, you know, newly opened. That's a holiday in across the road there, folks. That's where the Strictly Stars are supposed to be staying this uh, last few days. And we've got this tree just behind me, as I just said earlier. Hi, Leo. Go and see what we can find. Haha. <laughs> Never know in Blackpool. Walking past Mr. Bazaar's here. If you remember rightly in the uh, in the riots in the summer, they had all their windows put in. It wasn't nice. I don't deserve that, you know. This is this um, new DWP building. Let's see how they're getting on with this, shall we? Oh, wow. We have a building site going on here. Sorry, man, I'm not just being... All right. I wonder what they're building in that part. I mean, it's probably... Possibly, possibly a car park, I'd imagine. Oh, yeah, this bit. Yeah, I just saw, talking to a chap there, and um, he was told by one of the builders yesterday that it's going to be the car park. So, quite a big car park, really, isn't it? That's going to be the entrance to the place there. King Street Dental Surgery. Just there. Well, I think most of the actual building itself is um, is actually finished now. But uh, they're doing the outside stuff around. I'll go around the back and have a look around the back for you in a minute, folks. And they're doing this car park. Dental surgery. I guess obviously this will be the entrance here to the car park. I haven't been told it's going to be open uh, next year. Look like doing a bit of landscaping here, folks. A bit of greenery going on. Making it all look look pretty. But for how much? For how long though? Once it's opened. Yeah, so they're putting some trees in here, folks. 
Like these cost 10 grand, like them other ones around the corner, Cookson Street. And it costs a fair bit, I reckon. Fair bit. You don't get many um, trees in Blackpool, not in the town centre anyway. Open there. <laughs> yeah. Lots of greenery. Well, that tiger's pretty cool. Yorkshire Fisheries. Apparently, it's up for sale for a million quid. Yeah. Lovely artwork. <laughs> Just ahead of me, you've got a Washington pub. Highly recommend that. Got a lovely Sunday lunch in there. Let's turn, uh, let's turn into Topping Street, so look down here. Oh, so there's sneaker clean up that pool. Oh, if you want your trainers? If you want your trainers clean, you know where to go. <laughs> Pub on the corner of Churchill's. Well, this is Church Street, folks. leads on to uh, St John's Square that's where our main Christmas tree is just gives a wind noise and to my uh, right there is uh, Cedar Square Oh, well, no Christmas baubles here, but fine. You have to come down here at night time, you know. It's all the pretty Christmas lights. I hope this one don't get blown away this time. Last year it was blown away by one of those... I can't remember which storm it was, by one of them strong storms last year. That's our tree. That's the hive there. I recommend going in there. That is so nice. The food is absolutely beautiful in there. It's not the cheapest, but you know, you get what you pay for in the end of the day, don't you? Town's looking pretty busy on the Saturday afternoon. It's like the old nail bar that burnt down Christ, a couple of years ago now. Now the Emporium. They yeah, still haven't done there, nothing to it at all. Blackpool Bell's got some great footage of this, so if you check it out, Blackpool Bell. I think she's got about 25,000 views on it, on the fire. She was down here at the time.
Grand Theatre's having some uh, work done on it. Quite smart. Definitely have to come down here at Christmas time. Christmas time. <laughs> have to come down here at night time. It is Christmas time, huh. unfortunately. Yeah. I said these at night, they're pretty smart. So we can see any. We're at the back of the town now, so we can find anyone famous, shall we? Well, they got the um, all this all cordoned off here. That's where all the uh, camera stuff and all that is here. Look. Oh. You can actually get through there. Go down and have a look in a minute. in here then. Oh. What are they queuing up for? Ah, uh, I know. They're the lucky, they're the lucky buggers who won tickets strictly tonight. I tried to last, God knows how many years, never been successful. Coming up there, getting the strictly look. There's another queue here. Blimey. Show town across the road. That's always good. I've been in there in March. I've only been there once this year. Locals can get in there free. These are always down here, the Indian panpipes. To uh, strictly at the moment, look. They all got those little bags. They have to put their phones in. Yeah, take your phones. I don't like that idea much at all. So it's a bit of a windy alley here, folks, that's what I call it, for a better wind noise. Mm 
massive queue there. So we've got this all roped off, all fenced off folks. It's all the uh, trucks and uh, light and engineer and all that sort of thing going on. It's at the bottom here, it's Christmas by the sea across the road. Loads and loads of equipment here, look at these folks. Apparently judges arrive tonight about 15 minutes before they go on air. Uh, but I don't think it'll be lucky to see anyone today. Yes, security there. Um, Nothing's happening, unfortunately. There's a lot of hopeful people here, hoping to see something. Well, folks, I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, see a tower behind me and Sky Dance. Uh, talk about Sky Dance. It's not been working since Christmas and Sea opened last night. It hasn't been working. Um, Low down is, um, got technical issues with it, something to do with a computer I think, but I bet their guard will lose a lot of money. I dare say they'll have it up and running very soon anyway. I hope you enjoyed this vlog, um, I've been uh, trying to spot someone famous, but unfortunately I wasn't very lucky today. <laughs> it's strictly in town, as I said earlier, and um, Wait star spot. I've been wandering around about the last hour and a half around by the tower, etc. Hoping and hoping to find somebody that I that are famous. Um, but it weren't to be. Anyway, I expect some a lot of YouTubers have got some people celebrities out there anyway. Anyway, it weren't to be, so yeah, if you like the vlog and you like my stuff, please like and subscribe, hit the notification bell. We up a uh, load more videos like this. And um <laughs> I'm going home for a hot cup of coffee now because I'm absolutely freezing. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye bye for now. Bye.